Ghost Recon Wildlands has potential to be one of the best games that Ubisoft has created in a very long time, and in this video, we'll be taking a look at 8 things you need to know about the game. Number 1. Unlike Ghost Recon Advanced Warfighter or Future Soldier, Wildlands will not feature a futuristic setting. Instead, the game is set in modern day, similar to the original Ghost Recon. As a result, the weaponry in the game will be typical and more realistic, similar to weapons militaries would have these days. Number 2. As far as the exact setting goes, the game is set in Bolivia. Players play as a member of the Ghost, a fictional elite team in the United United States Army. Number 3. The game will be the first of the Ghost Recon games to have a fully open world environment. This open world features 9 different types of terrains including jungles, mountains, and deserts. It also has a dynamic day and night cycle and a weather system. Ubisoft also says that this will be the largest open world game that they've ever created and considering they've done some pretty big Assassin's Creed games that will be quite a feat. Number 4. When you're in the world not completing missions, players can interact and build friendly or hostile relationships with the NPCs, such as citizens, officials, or the rebels. These interactions require a level of strategy as they will bring consequences, impact the game's world, and change how players complete objectives. Number 5. Speaking of the NPCs, the people you see in Ghost Recon Wildlands will have their own objectives and lifestyles. They'll not only react to your actions, but changes in the weather or the time of day. Ubisoft is trying to actually create an ever-flowing world where things progress even if you're not present to do anything and interact with them. Number 6. The game features a standard progression system where the player will gain experience points for completing various objectives to level up. The character can also be customized by the loot found on enemies' corpses, and weapons and gear can also be upgraded. Number 7. Players can have multiple options in how they complete objectives. Whether it's utilizing stealth, melee combat, using long-ranged or short-ranged gadgets, the game will provide a lot of options for the gamer. This is a Ghost Recon game, so the developer wanted to have a level of strategy that can be used in the game to tackle various objectives. And finally, number 8, Ghost Recon Wildlands is being designed to be played with cooperation. The co-op mode supports up to 4 players that are traveling around the world together. And if you decide to play the game without any other real life players, you'll have 3 teammates but they will be controlled by the AI. Yeah, if you're gonna play Ghost Recon Wildlands, make sure you set up a group of friends to play with. So that wraps up our 8 things to know about Ghost Recon Wildlands. Are you excited for the game? Are you going to pick it up day 1? Let us know in the comment section down below. As always, have a great day and thank you for watching. Goodbye.